the circulatory system. The human body is made up of different organs, the brain, heart, lungs, liver, stomach and kidneys are some of the major internal organs of the body. These organs make up various body systems. Each of these body systems plays an important role in functioning of the human body. You have already studied in class 4 about the digestive and excretory system. The digestive system helps us to digest the food we eat. The excretory system helps to remove waste matter from the body. In this chapter, we shall study about the circulatory system. The circulatory system. The circulatory system moves blood throughout the body. The blood carries oxygen and nutrients to different parts of the body and removes waste from them. The organs of the circulatory system are the heart and the blood vessels. Heart. The heart is at the center of the circulatory system. It is a muscular organ located slightly to the left of the middle of the chest. It is the size of a cleansed first. It is like a machine that pumps blood to the rest of the body. The heart has four chambers. The upper two chambers are the right and left atria. The lower two chambers are the right and left ventricles. The chambers are separated by walls. The, there are valves between the chambers which open and close like doors. The Bells control the flow of blood from the chamber to another and to the rest of the body. The bells ensure that blood flows through the heart in one direction only. Blood vessels the tubes that go in and out of the heart are called blood vessels. There are like the pipelines of the body carrying blood and from the heart. There are three main types of blood vessels, arteries, veins and capillaries. Arteries carry blood reach in oxygen from the heart to the body. They have thick muscular walls. The main arti the main arti in the human body is called orta. It comes out of the heart and divides into smaller vessels to form a network in the body. Veins bring blood that is low in oxygen from the body back to the heart. They are thinner than arthritis. Veins have valves which prevent the blood from flowing backwards. The main veins in the human body are the superior vena cava and the inferior vena cava. Capillaries connect the arteries and the veins. They are the thinnest blood vessels. Blood. Blood is mainly made up of a pale yellow liquid called plasma. It contains three types of cells, namely red blood cells, which carry oxygen throughout the body and give blood its blood. It's and give blood its red color. White blood cells which fight infections. Platelets which 
help to stop bleeding if there is a cut blood has the following functions it carries oxygen and nutrients to all the cells in the body it takes away waste from the cells it transports substances that control many of the body functions it helps to regulate our body temperature it helps to fight infections circulation of blood the blood moves in blood vessels by the pumping action of the heart this pumping action of the heart is called heart beat blood enters and leaves the heart with every heart beat the human heart beats 60 to 80 times a minute while a person is at rest it is constantly pumping blood even while we are asleep when we run or exercise our muscles need more oxygen and nutrients the heart beats faster to provide more blood to the muscles after we stop exercising the heart beat gradually slows down process of circulation oxygen poor blood from the body is carried by the superior vena cava and the inferior vena cava to the right side of the heart from here the blood is pumped into the lungs in the lung the waste gases are removed from the blood which we breathe out at the same time the blood collects oxygen from the air present in the lungs the oxygen rich blood in is pumped back into the left side of the heart from there the arteries circulate it to the rest of the body